Now with a few of the boys popping the question this year, we thought we'd get a couple of the better engagement stories thanks to Rosendorf Jewelers. So when I was um, going to ask my fiance to uh, marry me, I had the wedding ring in my hand. So it was in my pocket, pulled it out, and I was going to take it to the nice um, spot in Hawaii where we were overlooking the waves and that. And as we're walking there, um, tripped on a rock, I fell over, I literally fell on the floor, and I ripped the ring in my hand. And Emmy gave me a hand to try and help me up. And I was like, no, 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 all, all good. I could barely speak, I was sweating profusely. And then, yeah, she turned around and I just dropped the knee. So, that's my story. I proposed to Shay, got engaged in New York, and I planned to do it in Hawaii on the way home. And then, the, my ring was in the bottom of my bag in a footy sock, and it was just burning away at me the whole trip, knowing it was there. So I was just like, one day in New York, had a really nice day, and then just did it out of the blue, because I was, would have been too nervous to wait till the end of the trip to Hawaii, so I got it out of the way early, which is good. Yeah. It sounds a little naive, but when I went to get Alex, my fiance, soon to be wife, her engagement ring, I walked into the jeweler, and uh, he said, okay, what, what do you want? And I said, oh, I'm looking for an engagement ring. Right. And he's like, what, what, what sort of ring would you like? And I was like, well, <laughs> preferably a circular one that goes on a finger with a diamond in it. He's like, well, no, you need to pick diamond size, color. And I was as rattled as it, I was as rattled as it gets. And I walked straight out of there, didn't order the diamond ring. Having old school values, I really wanted to ask Hannah's dad if I could uh, marry her and I actually asked him the first time I ever met him at, and it was actually at his 60th birthday and inadvertently had way too much wine and he approached Hannah straight after to talk to her about the upcoming <laughs> engagement with obviously she had no idea about and so I'm in the background going, <laughs> oh, it's uh, all, all worked out fine. I proposed to my now wife on an island. I took her across there on a dinghy and pretty much said, if you say no, uh, you're swimming back. <laughs> if you're looking to spoil that special someone in your life or perhaps just want to treat yourself to a bit of sparkle, make sure you visit Rosendorf Jewelers, the jewellery and diamond experts who will provide exquisite quality and first-class customer service to you.